Hey folks, Breakaway Homesteader here, and I promised you as we got uh, through our upgrades to our home that uh, we'd fill you in on it. Here's our latest addition here. This is Rookie. Hey Rookie, what are you doing? The most curious cat in the world. Anyway, we're in our spare bathroom. It's actually our son's son's bathroom where we give him a bath, everything like that. And it is 80s-tastic. Uh, you can see the blue sink there. You got the blue tub. And you got the blue uh, toilet there. And what we're going to do today is go ahead and rip this old linoleum out. One of our cats got locked in here and was trying to get out. And, uh, you know, we came home after the work day and let him out, of course. He was fine. But he was adamant about getting out. But uh, we got friends coming over next weekend, so we thought we'd go ahead and update this floor. However, we always plan on putting hardwood flooring. You can see the lip of the hardwood flooring inside the, the hallway uh, onto this floor. But uh, times are tight right now, as always. And so we are going to just be putting some peel and stick linoleum down. And uh, you can see how much of a difference 35 bucks can make to a single uh, room. Uh, so, yeah, it's about $35 to replace this entire floor uh, with some decent looking linoleum. So, we'll see how it turns out. We're ripping the linoleum up, and one dilemma we've come across is this vanity. This vanity was built into the actual uh, bathroom, and so the linoleum underneath it. So I'm going to see about maybe placing a car jack underneath that so I can lift it up just a few millimeters just to get that uh, uh, linoleum out. Got a very special kitty. Just seems to be in everything. This car jack is too uh, too high off the ground to lift off the bottom of the <coughs> footer edge here, so we're gonna use a little strap and see about doing it that way. You can see here I took a webbing strap or a toe strap and put it around the border and pulled up the uh, the vanity here. It's built in, so I got to get the linoleum out from underneath it with uh, a car jack, which seems to be doing the trick. And that stuff should come right out. We'll see. All right, folks. So here is the thirty-five dollar transition. Wasn't hard at all. See, it will take some time. It's very humid in the house for these tiles to adhere, adhere, stick to the floor. But uh, they're getting there. Every day I come through and, and push down on tiles to make sure they are adhering. That's the word. But I think it looks pretty darn good. Put some cord around from the uh, hardwood floor. And also in front of the tub, so it makes it look better. But, that's what it is.